In this video, I'm going to show you how if you use scan in barcodes, you can automatically turn the ones that have been received green. I had this question from somebody the other day and he had a long list of um, product IDs and he just wanted to scan them and them to turn green when um, they were received. So let's try this out. Um, I'm going to select the second one. So this, this is the cell that I'm going to put them in and I'm going to go four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now I'm going to press that. Enter similar to the barcode scanner does. And it automatically turns the, the product green because it has been received. So now let me show you the code. The first thing I'm going to show you is on the worksheet so that this does it automatically. If you right click on the worksheet and you go view code, you can see that it says um, private sub worksheet change by value. Um, so the intersect, the, the B2 is, uh, is the cell that they're looking at. If something happens there, so this is like reverse logic. If not intersect is nothing. So basically if something is put in there, you're going to call the, the program green. And, um, and then, so in module one, here's my green. And so then I declare uh, barcode is a string range. RNG is a range row number as long. And so if sheet one sells two, uh, two, two, so that's B2. If it's not blank, then um, barcode equals sheet one sells two, two. So then it's going to search down the A column. Um, and if the range is, is nothing, then the message box is going to be not found and then it's going to exit sub and if it finds the number what it's going to do is it's going to select um, the sheet one row number whatever row it's on and the first column because that's where they are and the active cell interior uh, color is equals four which is uh, green and then we're going to go sheets um, one we're going to empty out the b column so that you can scan in the next product and then you're going to go and select the B column so you're re ready to enter the next one. Um, I will, of course, include all this code in the description of my video. Please subscribe.